Hey y'all, it's your girl Audrey Narena, and today we are back at it with another. Why does this always happen to me? Like, for today's video, I'm going to be doing my makeup. If, like, I've done this on TikTok before, but I've never done it on my channel. And y'all also finna get high with me because this is a 420 friendly channel. So if you don't like to watch me smoke, I don't know what to tell you. I don't wear makeup every day, so today's video is literally just gonna be me showing you guys like what products I use on my face when I do use them on my face. I feel like makeup makes me feel cakey, you know? Like it makes my skin feel very dirty. So, and also y'all, I put this wig on today, so make sure y'all go watch my little wig video on TikTok at Audra Narana. But y'all, having black hair, I don't ever get to wear one of these because it just looks stupid. Like, it just looks so dumb. So I'm about to roll up and I'll be back listening to music. A few moments later. Do I have my phone right here? I'm just gonna start playing music and I'm just gonna put the songs in the thing. I'm gonna be rolling up and I can't show that on camera. So, yeah. Yo, I ain't even gonna lie, this shit had me in a chokehold when I was growing up. Like, why was I listening to this in like second grade? y'all today i'm gonna roll a cinnamon stick because it's just me myself and i you roll with tussin even though that's not what the fuck he says that's what he said and i also have a t-shirt on too ho like bro right when no one is around you say baby i love you y'all smoking is a whole experience like Would you like it if I came over with my click? Gotta bounce when two seconds ago said you just got in the house. This used to be that shit. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I have a very versatile playlist. I can't even talk. I listen to any and everything. I'm just gonna be smoking for this part, and then I'm gonna put background music when I actually start doing my makeup. But I'm still gonna show y'all. Beneficial. I can't show no feelings. Keep relaxing. And I if you got a blunt bitch, smoke with me. You can't see but every day. I got too much money for my mom to work a job. I know she proud now. I can style now. And I got it blicky for that rah rah. This was that shit. I don't care what nobody say. If you know, you know. Can you guess the song? So spike me, white girl, ice tea. I just fuck your bitch. That's some Gucci flip flops. Y'all, I'm so fried. Manipulator, Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. The real Okay, y'all, I ain't gonna lie. I'm about to put this out, and we're about to get started on my makeup because I don't think I can smoke anymore. Okay, y'all. I have this makeup bag. Before, I never really had a makeup bag. And this one is from Sophia Joy. I got this from Walgreens, y'all. I think it was like $30. If I can find the link, I'll put it in the description box. I just have all like my foundations, my mascaras, my but I'm not putting them on because I have lash extensions. But like all my foundation, my concealers, my beauty blenders, my blushes, everything. My primer, so we're about to get into it. So for my primer, I use the Liss secure skin gripping serum primer i had an ipsy subscription so this is how i actually have this um would i say i like this primer honestly i haven't really experimented with enough primers to really know oh my gosh y'all i need a mirror okay well that's awkward i can't find the mirror but guess my juvia's place little bronzer thing will have to do you guys might see me looking down but if i'm looking down it's because i put my mirror right here and always make sure that you wash your hands before you do any of this too. <gasps> oh! Also guys, I don't really have good skin. I mean, it's all right, but I definitely have textured skin. I just let that kind of get sticky on my face and then I go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills, this thing. I don't even know what it's called, y'all. 
the dip brow pomade and I use it in the shade ebony ew that primer has my hands feeling nasty y'all my skin is starting to get like sticky <clears throat> is that supposed to happen with primer I feel like low-key that's why I never really used to experiment with primers I go in with this brush I literally have no idea where it's from so please do not ask me I can't even read it anymore And when I go in on my eyebrows, I like to thicken them a little bit. I try not to make them too thick. And my eyebrows aren't even. This one is like a lot more lifted up. Yeah, but I'm just going to fill them in on camera and you guys are going to see. I fill them in really thick because I use my concealer to thin them out but kind of get a nice blend and make sure that I put enough product on my eyebrows. And the concealer that I'm going to be using for my eyebrows is Too Faced Born This Way in the Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer in the shade Warm Sand. I use a brush. I like the brushes that I use to have like the rounded tip on it so it can kind of just sculpt my eyebrows as I go. I literally can't find anything today. I'm just gonna go in with this slanted brush. So when I'm done with that, I push the line up the middle of concealer, just like this, kind of to split them up. I use this brush. I don't want it to look so bright so I turn my lighting down a little bit but once I finish my eyebrows I do have my lashes done if I was doing a regular makeup routine I would definitely go into my lashes now but next I'm gonna be going in with my foundation this is the foundation that I go in with I don't know how to use this y'all so if I'm using this the wrong way do not come for me But I was just putting my foundation on. Now we are going to. Also, going to be going in with Too Faced Born This Way foundation as well. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just gonna have to do shorter clips, so I'm not gonna be able to put it in fast forward anymore if I don't want my camera to overheat. But next, I'm gonna be going in with my concealer, and I'm going in with the same concealer that I did with my eyebrows. And I blend it all out with this brush. Once I'm done blending my concealer, I do my contour. And for my contour, I literally use the Juvia's Place bronzed, bronzed bronzer in the shade Dark. And I just use a kind of smaller brush to go in and do so. When I get done with that, I bake. And for my baking powder, I use the... The Airspun Loose Face Powder. That's all y'all getting because I don't know nothing else. Now that I have that all put on, I'm going to go in and I'm going to do my lips. I don't ever use color on my lips. I do use lip liner. So, and now you go in with the NYX Professional. It's actually eyeliner, but I don't care. And it's literally in the shade brown. So, And it's supposed to be waterproof. And I learned this on TikTok. But I go in with a little bit of my concealer. But you don't want to use too much. So, And then I go in with my Juvia's Place lip gloss. And this one is in glass. Let me get y'all a close up. I'm just going to let my face bake for about 5 minutes or so and then I'll come back and I'll have it all off. It's been about 5 minutes so I'm just going to go in with this big brush. This came with an Ipsy subscription too but it says blush brush if that helps anything. And I know I look like Michael Jackson right now but it's really not that bad. Then I go in with my bronzer that I use to contour my nose and I just do this along my cheeks. And I put mascara on my bottom lashes and I go in with the Better Than Sex waterproof one. This one's the blue one with the butterflies on it. I just thought it was so pretty. The last step is highlighter and I use 
a Lisa Frank highlighter and it's a stargazing shimmer eyeshadow. I think it's so pretty, y'all. After I let that settle in, I went in and cleaned off my nose piercings. And this is the final look. So thank you guys for watching and let me know what other kind of videos you guys want to see. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Thank you. And I'm going to try and get better at posting. So y'all will see me soon.